that stunning new book by the prominent doctor who not only claims he's been to heaven, but says he can prove it. Eben Alexander almost died four years ago when an infection attacked his brain. Now he's revealing his experience in his book, Proof of Heaven, and Nightline anchor Terry Moran has his story. Eben Alexander is a healthy 58-year-old Harvard-trained neurosurgeon, a man of science, an expert on the brain, and he's got something extraordinary to tell you. Did you go to heaven? Yes. Four years ago, Alexander nearly died from a massive brain infection that plunged him into a coma and shut down nearly his entire mind. He was barely alive in this world, but he says he journeyed elsewhere. I was rescued by this beautiful spinning white light that had a, a melody, indescribably beautiful melody, that opened up into a bright valley very verdant valley, blossoming flowers. And he says God was there as a vast presence of infinite love. He met a young woman, he says, his guide as they soared on a butterfly wing, and she gave him a message from heaven. You are loved, you are cherished, there's nothing you have to fear, there's nothing you can do wrong. A lot of people are gonna say, doctor, it was a hallucination. I know this was not a hallucination, not a dream, not what we call a confabulation. I know that it really occurred, and I know it occurred outside of my brain. As a neurosurgeon and a skeptic about God before his coma, Alexander says there is no scientific explanation for what he experienced, given how sick his brain was, how near death. Other scientists dismiss his claims, but there's this. After he recovered, he was sent a picture of a long dead sister he had never met or seen. It was her, the girl he believes he saw on the butterfly wing in heaven. It was the most profound experience I've ever had in this life. For Good Morning America, Terry Moran, ABC News, Lynchburg.